uh, my foot. I was playing soccer and I jumped up to headbutt the ball and I came down on one foot and my foot kind of just shot out and everyone heard a loud like pop slash cracking noise. Uh, not everyone, most of the people that were there. Um, it was the worst pain I've ever been in in my life and uh, I explained a little bit of this on Instagram but I just wanted to make this video to inform you guys what's going on right now. So. I just went to, I just went to the doctor, um, and they said that uh, my ankle is pretty messed up. Um, there may be a bone that is um, broken in my foot, and uh, I say may because they don't actually know yet because they usually find out a week later. It's kind of one of those weird things that shows up a week later if it is um, existent. So that's kind of weird, but. Um, what they said was, and I'm sure they they kind of tell you a lot of the worst case scenarios just because they need to, they don't want to tell somebody um, something that's more, less likely to happen, but that is better because when it doesn't happen, then whatever, they can get in trouble. So uh, whatever, what they said was that this type of fracture or break or whatever um, usually ends sports careers when it doesn't heal correctly but um, I'm sure that that is not the case um, if it is fractured um, I'm gonna do everything I can and it's gonna be okay uh, I'm gonna listen to them do what they say and it's gonna heal properly and we'll be good to go luckily um, bodybuilding as a sport is not as uh, would the word be it's not intense as intense on your joints and everything like uh with um like quick muscle fiber what's that called fast twitch so fast twitch muscle fibers in bodybuilding you don't use a whole lot of fast twitch muscle fibers um you don't do really explosive movements like you do in football or things like that and i think that's more what they're referring to because that's a lot more intense on your ankles uh requires a lot more from them so luckily um i should be good just because of um, that, even if something were to be very wrong, um, but I am good. I will keep up with the YouTube videos. Um, quick update, I am looking to get um, the Sony RX100 Mark V uh, for vlogging and for Instagram. Uh, my Instagram is right here. Um, so we're going to Florida in a couple weeks to visit my grandparents, so hopefully I can get that camera before then, um, and we can get some sweet pictures and videos. I will be vlogging um, a lot in Florida. I'm getting some good stuff. Um, hopefully I'll be able to walk around on my foot by then and I'll be able to uh, film in the gym my workouts and whatnot. So that's what's going on right now. Um, everything else is good. It's just my foot. So I have crutches which is holding up the camera so I can't really... Here we go. I have one right here. Um, I'll be in crutches and in this boot for, um, I think they said, I think they said it was like a couple to a few weeks, but um, I don't think, I think I should be able to walk around before then with it being fine, so we'll be good. Um, so that's what's going on. Thank you guys for watching the video. I'm going to do, the next video I'm doing is going to be measuring my arms, my legs, my waist, all of that. So that's highly um, recommended. Not recommended. Uh, that's highly... People want to see it, is what I'm trying to say. So um, I'm going to do that next, and I will see you in the next video. So thank you for watching. Uh, thank you for all the support. I got over like 50 Instagram messages, uh, DMs, comments, um, wishing me well and that I'd get better. Um, with the exception of a few people who are a little, a little mean, but um, that's all right. Uh, it is my fault, like they said. It is my fault that this happened. Um, but I will be back lifting again and everything will be fine. Just will take a little bit of time. So again, thank you for watching and I will see you in the next video.